You all right? No, I'm not all right, Mike. Three days of got my nerves all rattled. My still hurts. Hey. Who are you talking about, Mr. Brown? What they? They. Look at it. Kareem Akbar. That's right, the educated brother from the bank. He's the real head of the CMB. The brave is Kevin Hart concealing a secret that could rock Hollywood to its foundations? This question is igniting intense debates following Cat Williams' bombshell claims regarding the comedy superstar's rise to fame. According to Williams, Hart's success may not solely stem from talent or hard work, but rather from the intricate web of Hollywood's hidden power dynamics. And guess who's allegedly tangled up in this drama? None other than Sean Diddy Combs. The speculation began when Cat Williams took the stage, openly suggesting that Hart's career isn't as straightforward as it appears. Williams asserted that Hart's ascent was influenced by powerful industry figures, hinting at a behind-the-scenes arrangement that propelled him to stardom. He specifically called out Diddy, who has long been rumored to exert a controversial influence over Hollywood, leveraging his connections in ways that extend beyond merely producing music or managing artists. While Diddy has faced years of allegations regarding wild parties and his sway over industry success, these latest claims add a new layer to the way we perceive Kevin Hart's career trajectory. What the number one job of somebody that sold their soul in Hollywood is? What? Is to act like it didn't happen. They all do the same job of these words. These people are not powerful. Satan can't create anything. That includes blessings for his people. That's why. As you can see, Cat Williams didn't hold back when he dropped a bombshell, accusing Kevin Hart of engaging in compromising behavior with Diddy. According to Williams, this covert arrangement paved the way for Hart to achieve a level of Hollywood fame far beyond what most comedians can attain. Cat didn't just throw out vague allegations. He provided details on how Kevin's swift ascent was allegedly linked to private deals and secret handshakes with some of the industry's most powerful figures, with P. Diddy at the center of it all. But this isn't just a one-time claim. The tension between Cat Williams and Kevin Hart stretches back years and is much more complicated than a simple comedic rivalry. While Kevin was busy building his brand through movies and sold-out tours, Kat's career seemed to spiral into chaos, marked by arrests and strange incidents. However, according to Kat, this wasn't merely a case of bad luck or poor choices on his part. He claimed that he turned down a similar opportunity presented by Diddy, and as a result, his mainstream success took a nosedive. Turned down $50 million four times four times just to protect my integrity and that I was telling you about <laughs> right because uh, P Diddy be wanting to party and you gotta tell him no oh, you Lord. got to tell him no I, I did I did oh, see I got the receipts for everything I'm telling you that's why I can yeah, say yeah, I'm, I'm so freely I need to know you I've cats revelations portray him as someone who chose integrity over fame but that decision came at a significant cost to his career he believes Kevin made the opposite choice, one that allegedly came with its own set of sacrifices, compromising himself for the financial and professional gains that followed. This backstory explains why Kat has been so outspoken about Kevin Hart. He views him not just as a rival, but as someone who accepted a deal that Kat himself refused, making their feud all the more personal. Meanwhile, Diddy's involvement in this entire scenario cannot be overlooked. He has long been regarded as one of the most influential figures in Hollywood's shadowy power dynamics, known for hosting exclusive parties that only the elite could attend. Diddy's gatherings have sparked endless speculation. According to various sources, these events had an air of control, suggesting that attending didn't just imply membership in the inner circle, but that attendees might owe something in return. The cult-like atmosphere surrounding Diddy's parties has been discussed for years. 
with claims that these events were designed to test the loyalty and compliance of rising celebrities with the rules of Hollywood's elite. Cat Williams was candid in describing these parties as venues where deals were struck, not just professional ones. He implied that those who attended Diddy's alleged gatherings often found themselves in compromising situations, and Kevin Hart was reportedly no stranger to these events. There is considerable evidence suggesting that he and Diddy shared a closer bond than what appears on the surface. Viral clips from Diddy's parties show Kevin laughing, joking, and engaging in behaviors that some fans found questionable. Other celebrities, like Usher, have also been linked to these gatherings, intensifying the belief that these events were more than just social affairs. They were a means for Diddy to exert control over other stars. To New York City. And I lived with Sean Puffy Combs for a year. That's the crazy thing. Now, that yeah. was L.A. Reid's idea, right? We're sending New you over York to City. something called Puffy Flavor Camp. There you go. To learn <laughs> some... Flavor Camp! Yeah, Flavor that's camp. what it was called. And you're going to go to Puff Daddy's. He's In pre- the 90s. Do you understand what that's like? Puffy's place was like just filled with chicks and orging like nonstop, right? No, nah, not really. I Come mean, on. but did I, hey, it was curious. I got a chance to see some things. Yeah, but you were 13. What were you I seeing? I went there to see the lifestyle. Right. And, and I saw it. And it was, and it was, <laughs> but I don't know if I could indulge and understand what I was even looking at. It was, it was pretty wild. It was, so nobody it was tried to, you know, some woman didn't come along. I didn't say that. Okay. I, I didn't but say you that. Didn't, <laughs> what I did say is that there were very curious things taking place. Uh huh. And I didn't necessarily understand it. Uh huh. Biggie Smalls was there. Biggie Smalls was there. Lil Kim, Craig Mack. All know, these people all are hanging these, around. All, yeah, man. Faith Evans. Joey your C- Yo, what, what the, the fuck did Puff just say? Nobody's gonna acknowledge this for me. Puff just said we used to wrestle over the Frosted Flakes and we're streaming live. That was stupid. Listen, that was f- stupid. Listen. According to Kat, this issue goes beyond mere financial gain. It's about influence and the willingness to adhere to Hollywood's unspoken rules. This accusation implies that Kevin's career success isn't solely attributed to his talent, but also involves personal compromises. Compounding the speculation are viral clips from Diddy's parties that show Kevin Hart's behavior raising a few eyebrows. In one well-known video, he appears to be laughing and joking in a manner that struck some viewers as overly familiar, especially in light of the ongoing discussions about his connection with Diddy. One particularly talked-about incident occurred at one of Diddy's hot tub parties, where Kevin's reaction to the situation sparked concern for those already skeptical of their relationship. While some dismissed it as just Kevin being humorous, others perceived it as another hint that something was off. Which, as you see, is female-friendly. We got a lady that's a female. She's b****. That's what I call it, raw dog. It's all love here, okay? I'm tipsy. Everybody's tipsy. Uh, get in the tub, sweetie. Be careful. If you fall, that's a lot that's gonna go down. Girl, sit your tub. The mix of viral clips, Cat Williams' relentless accusations, and Diddy's parties has many questioning whether Kevin Hart's success story has a darker side. In Cat's view, Hollywood is not merely a glamorous realm of fame and fortune. It's a playground dominated by a few powerful gatekeepers who determine who rises to the top and who does not. He believes figures like Diddy hold the keys to success, using their influence to shape the careers of emerging stars. Kat has consistently detailed how these gatekeepers operate behind the scenes, deciding who gets famous based not only on talent, but also on who is willing to conform to their hidden rules. It's not just about making deals or building connections. It's about yielding to the demands of the industry's most powerful players. He positions himself as someone who has stood up to these power dynamics, portraying himself as a rebel who refuses to bow to the system. He's been outspoken about his choice to avoid the manipulations and backroom deals that allegedly facilitate mainstream success for stars like Kevin Hart. For Kat, This conflict transcends personal rivalry. 
he sees it as a moral battle between those willing to sell out for fame and those, like him, who resist these temptations. He claims that his refusal to play the game is why his career hasn't reached the same heights as Kevin's. This raises an important point in Kat's allegations about the impact of these power structures on careers. He suggests that rejecting the rules set by figures like Diddy often leads to career setbacks. Kat believes his struggles with mainstream success, despite his undeniable talent, are directly tied to his resistance. In contrast, he accuses Kevin Hart of submitting to control in exchange for fame and fortune. Kat's story is not merely about two comedians with divergent paths. It reflects how the darker aspects of Hollywood affect those who dare to stand against it. Diddy, of course, is a central figure in this narrative, and recent events have intensified speculation surrounding his influence. His recent arrest has become a hot topic, with sealed charges leaving many to wonder about the nature of his legal troubles. Some speculate that Diddy's past is finally catching up with him, suggesting that his once unshakable grip on Hollywood might be weakening. These legal issues lend weight to Cat Williams' claims, indicating that Diddy's influence may not be as steadfast as it once appeared. Complicating matters further are allegations from singer Cassie, who accuses Diddy of years of abuse and manipulation. While the details of her lawsuit differ from Cat's claims, they share a common thread. The portrayal of Diddy as someone who has exploited his power in disturbing ways this lawsuit adds to the complexity of Diddy's reputation, painting a darker picture of how he wields his influence, not just within the music industry, but also over people's personal lives. On the other hand, Kevin Hart has remained silent amid all these allegations. Despite Kat's explosive claims and Diddy's escalating legal issues, Kevin has not issued any public statements addressing the situation. Hey, Kevin, when you hosted for Diddy, did you catch any baby oil? You'll see, um, when I hosted for Diddy? Yeah. Yeah. Nah? You asked the wrong person the wrong question. <laughs> your question. Do you think he's safe in jail? Wrong person, wrong question. <laughs> you know, if you're not for me, you're not for me. Kevin Hart's silence has only intensified speculation, leaving fans to ponder its implications. The online discourse surrounding Cat Williams' claims is hard to overlook, with social media buzzing with opinions about the veracity of these accusations. Many are aligning with Cat's depiction of Hollywood's darker side. One thing is certain— Kat's allegations have ignited a significant conversation about the industry, its gatekeepers, and the compromises that celebrities may be compelled to make in their pursuit of success. Do you think Kevin Hart's rapid ascent to fame came at a hidden cost? With Cat Williams stirring up controversy and Diddy's influence over Hollywood under serious scrutiny, it's natural to wonder if there's more to this story. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this entire situation in the comments below. And remember, this isn't the conclusion of the saga. Hollywood is filled with secrets. As these power dynamics come under examination, more explosive revelations could be on the horizon. Stay tuned for future videos that delve into the untold stories of the industry's hidden forces. Make sure you're subscribed and have your notifications turned on so you don't miss any of the latest updates.